At five, a dialysis patient dies after the ambulance in which she is riding runs into a wall. Good evening. I'm Marsha Bonhart. I'm Michelle Kingsfield. It happened today on Interstate 75 near Edwin C. Moses. Shelby Costo live outside the hospital with how this tragedy unfolded. Shelby? Well, we're told a 66-year-old woman has died as a result of her injuries from this accident. Now, she was rushed here to the Miami Valley Hospital, but unfortunately passed away as doctors tried to save her. Now, Dayton police tell us an American ambulance was carrying the woman, a kidney dialysis patient, to a Kettering Hospital when the accident happened just before noon on I-75 on top of the Edwin C. Moses Boulevard exit. Officers tell us there were large cardboard boxes in the middle of the interstate that slowed traffic and the ambulance driver rear-ended a semi-truck then slammed into a concrete wall. The traffic came to a stop ahead of the ambulance. The driver of the ambulance stated that she clipped the rear end of a semi-truck and the ambulance continued and collided with the retaining wall. Uh, during that accident, the patient in the rear uh, was bounced around and received injuries from that accident. Now we're told the ambulance driver and another paramedic received injuries. The driver was treated and released from the hospital and the other paramedic has a fractured leg and he is still here at the hospital. Now we're told no charges or citations have been given, but Dayton police tell us this accident remains under investigation. Reporting live in Dayton, Shelby Costo, 2 News on your